How can you combine these words with these words? For my students, it's often a big mystery. I'm here to make things clear. I'm John, and today we're going to learn phrasal verb secrets to hold over. Emily and Carlos are co-workers. They're in the break room talking about food. Hey, Carlos, did you manage to eat lunch before the meeting? No, I didn't have time. Too much work, you know? You have to eat, Carlos. It's not good to work on an empty stomach. It's okay. I brought some snacks with me, so no worries. I also drink water to stay full and hydrated. What do you have? I have some fruit and a bag of cookies. It'll be enough to hold me over until I have the chance to have a proper meal. Quiz time! What does to hold over mean? To snack on things? To satisfy hunger temporarily? To eat lunch? To forget to eat? Please pause the video and answer the question. That's right, it's B, to satisfy hunger temporarily. Before we continue, do you want to choose the next phrasal verb lessons? Then join the channel membership today and become an English fan or an English explorer. Just click the link in the description. Now, let's study. Phrasal verb secrets. Hold over means to satisfy hunger, usually just a little bit, until the next meal. Over, in this case, means we are moving to the next moment and passing a certain time period. We can see this same meaning of over in the word overnight, for example, which means to move through the night, to the next day. This is also similar to other verbs with over, such as stay over or sleep over, which mean until the next day. Separation. We can separate some phrasal verbs. We have to memorize the verbs we can separate. This is a very difficult skill to learn, and there's no easy way except practice. It's best to repeat what you hear and hope to learn naturally. A great place to practice is the comment section. Hold over is a verb that is almost always separated we often add a person in the middle. This snack will hold me over until dinner. The sandwich I had for lunch is holding me over until dinner. A quick snack is enough to hold you over until the next meal. Verbs with over. These are verbs with similar meanings. If it helps, think of the word over like the shape of an arc. Hold over. Satisfy hunger until the next meal. Sleep over. Sleep at someone's house until the next day. Stay over. Stay at someone's house until the next day. Leave over. Leave something until the next day. Carry over. 
carry something until the next moment. Think over. Think about something until you make a decision. Stop over. Moving from one flight to the next at an airport. Examples. Carlos had an apple to hold him over until he could eat a proper meal. Sometimes a cup of coffee is enough to hold me over until lunch. I usually have a piece of fruit to hold me over during long meetings. If you're starving, eat something small to hold you over until your chance to eat. Extra examples. The kids were excited to sleep over at their grandparents' house for the weekend. Jennifer's parents allowed her to sleep over at her best friend's house for her birthday. Tom asked if he could stay over at his friend's place instead of driving back home. The couple decided to stay over at a hotel after attending the late night concert. The chef decided to leave the dough overnight to rise for better flavor. We have some leftover cake from yesterday. The discussion from yesterday carried over into today's meeting. The excitement from the game carried over into the celebrations on the streets. Before making the decision, she wanted to think over the offer. The students were asked to think over the questions and give the answers the next day. Due to bad weather, the plane had to stop over in Dubai. Our flight to Europe had a stopover in Istanbul. Vocabulary Extras Rewatch the video to catch the vocabulary. Did you manage to eat? Did you find the opportunity to eat? An empty stomach. A stomach with no food inside. A proper meal. A meal that is healthy. Starving. Dying of hunger. Thanks for watching. If you have a question or if you learned something useful, use the super thanks. You can support free English content. Please like, share, and subscribe and see you in the next lesson.